If your heart feels empty, you're worshiping a false god. Time to refocus. In the hustle and bustle of modern life, it's easy to lose sight of what truly matters. We often find ourselves chasing after things that promise happiness, but leave us feeling more empty than before. It's a cycle that can be hard to break, but recognizing the false gods in our lives is the first step. In today's world, idols aren't just golden statues. They have evolved and taken on new forms that are more subtle and insidious. Our smartphones, for instance, have become extensions of ourselves, demanding our constant attention and devotion. They come in the form of people, possessions, status. We seek validation through the things we own and the people we associate with, believing that these external factors can fill the void within us. We bow down to fame, fortune, and self-worth. The pursuit of success and recognition becomes our primary focus, overshadowing the more meaningful aspects of life. We measure our worth by the number of likes and followers, forgetting that true value comes from within. But these idols, they never satisfy. No matter how much we acquire or achieve, the sense of fulfillment remains elusive. We are left wanting more, trapped in a never-ending quest for something that cannot be found in material possessions. They only make you crave more, the more we indulge in these worldly desires, the deeper we sink into the abyss of dissatisfaction. It's a vicious cycle that can only be broken by turning our focus inward and seeking a higher purpose. When you seek the divine, you find real joy and peace. Spiritual practices like meditation and prayer can help us reconnect with our true selves and find a sense of inner peace that is not dependent on external circumstances. The kind that fills your soul deeply. This deep spiritual fulfillment is what we are truly seeking, even if we don't realize it. It is a sense of connection to something greater than ourselves, a feeling of being part of a larger divine plan. The world's glitter, it's just tin. The allure of worldly success and material wealth is like glitter, shiny and attractive on the surface, but ultimately hollow and worthless. But the light of his presence, it's brilliant and everlasting. The divine light, on the other hand, is a source of true and lasting joy. It illuminates our path and guides us toward a more meaningful and fulfilling life. Walk in the light with him and you'll become a beacon. By aligning ourselves with this divine light, we not only find our own path, but also become a source of inspiration and guidance for others. Others will be drawn to his brilliance through you. Your inner light will shine brightly, attracting others who are also seeking a deeper sense of purpose and fulfillment. Remember, you shall not make for yourself an idol. Exodus, April 5th, 20. This ancient wisdom reminds us to avoid the pitfalls of idolatry, whether in the form of material possessions or modern distractions. You are my lamp, O Lord. The Lord turns my darkness into light. 2 Samuel 22, 29. Shun modern idolatry. Embrace divine fulfillment. Let the divine light guide you out of the darkness of modern idolatry and into a life of true spiritual fulfillment. Like subscribe and share the light. Spread this message of hope and divine fulfillment. Encourage others to turn away from the false idols of modern life and embrace the true light that brings lasting joy and peace.